Greetings, cyber dogs and citizens of the internet. This is Ren Dog coming at you from the Leviathan's butthole in this Let's Play StarCraft II Heart of the Swarm series. In the previous episode, we had a freaking epic battle with Nerud, and damn, did we witness an epic cutscene. And before we get going with this video, guys, I just want to apologize um, to everybody who's been watching this series. Um, I want to apologize profusely for talking through the cutscenes. I. Uh, some of you guys have been saying that it's really annoying and I thought about it and you know what? It's exactly what my mother does when we watch movies together. She talks the whole freaking time and makes me freaking crazy. So guys, from now on, I'm not going to be talking in the cutscenes. So uh, <laughs> sorry about that. But guys, this is going to be freaking epic, man. We've basically unlocked all of the Zerg units um, that I know of. That means that we must be quite close to the end of this game. And we've got a, a conversation to be had with a giant space platform, apparently. Um, Isha, the butthole pro Stukov, the um, very phallic uh, shoulder blade guy. Um, nothing. Zagara's got nothing to say. Old Dahaka has got nothing to say. They've obviously had a fallout or something. And we're probably going to have something in the evolution pit. We'll go and check what old Assface has to say. So why don't we start with the evolution pit? In fact, I, I haven't. You know, I, I kind of miss Assface, man. We haven't had a conversation with old Assy for a while. And it looks like we've got an Ultimus mutation available. That is awesome. Um, let's have a look. Oh my goodness. How awesome does that Ultralisk look? Oh my god, look at him. He's so cute. Um, right, let's check what we've got. Burrow Charge. That is epic. Let's have a look in the video. Bam! Damn. Damn, son. That is insane. Um, tissue Assimilation. Gain life equal to 40% of all damage dealt from normal attacks. Jeez, man. That is insane. Or Monarch Blades. Gain 20% splash damage. An increase of 400%, causing attacks to deal 25 damage to both primary and secondary targets. Holy lord, that, is, that sounds freaking sweet. But um, I think the sweetest has got to be burrowing, burrowing ultralinks. I mean, I'm not entirely sure how physics-wise physics, physics -wise how it works. They are huge. It looks like he's burrowed through uh, pure steel there. But you know what? We're going to go with that one. Burrow charge, baby. That sounds sweet. And uh, old Abathur's got nothing to say to us. So back to the butthole we go. Let's start from the left all the way to the right. Let's start with the Skyga station. I'm coming for you, Mengsk. And you won't have any hybrid to protect you. <laughs> oh, Mengsk, we've got your number. The swarm was once Amon's tool. He will seek to use us again. I will prepare for his coming. But not until I'm done with Mengsk. Of course, my queen. Oh my god, that is insane, man. We're gonna be... Oh, the, the, now the last is piece. dead and the hybrid lab is destroyed. I am the final loose end. I suppose you kill me now. If you want to leave, I won't stop you. <laughs> Where would I go? Half man, half zerg. A monster. With that really dodgy thing on my shoulder. Believe me. Stay with the swarm. And perhaps the way will become clear. If nothing else, it will be interesting. Welcome, Stukov, to my army. Right, let's check if Kerrigan's got any available upgrades. My upgrade, queen, actually. you radiate with power. Your ultimate abilities have awakened. Oh god, we've got ultimate abilities, that is epic! Okay, let's have a look. Apocalypse deals 300 damage to enemy units and 700 damage to enemy structures in a large area. Oh my goodness, that is insane. Spawn Leviathan summons a mighty flying Leviathan. We can summon a butthole with timed life, deals massive damage and has energy based abilities. Drop pods delivers primal zerg with timed life to the battlefield. Drop pods contain 40 zerglings, 5 roaches and 5 hydralis. Damn son, that is insane. We've got to go with Apocalypse though, right? I mean that, that just sounds too freaking awesome to pass up on. Definitely going with Apocalypse I think. Oh my goodness guys. Oh my god, Kerrigan is just absolutely jam-packed with awesomeness at the moment. Um, there's, I just want to make sure, 100% sure we're doing everything that we want here. I love the automatic extractors, I love mend, I love chain reaction, um, I love twin drones, that is epic. I love the infest broodlings thing, uh, that is really sweet. Oh, wait, 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 we might change this actually, look. Kerrigan's abilities have their cooldown and energy cost reduced by 20%, and that means we'll be able to... Um, Minus 20% from the cooldown of Apocalypse. So I'll be having me some of that. Thank you very much. Just done a small adjustment there. Guys, we are ready to get on to the next freaking level. Oh my god, this is going to be insane. Isha, take the Leviathan up. We're leaving. Garrigan, you saw something in that lab. 
in Arud's mind. I saw Amon. Older than the universe, more powerful than I can understand. And now he's alive again. Then he shall fall before the swarm, like all the rest. We don't even know where he is. We must prepare for his coming. But I have a few scores to settle first. That is what I'm talking about. Older than the universe. Inform the Broodmothers. The swarm moves on Core Hall. At last, Megsk will suffer for his crimes. I mean, I, older than the universe, I, I mean, that's just dramatic. And not possible either. Well, I guess it's possible. But highly unlikely. I'm going to Core Hall. It's time. Why are you telling us this, Kerrigan? There will be ruin, destruction, millions can die amid the chaos. Valerian, your people will need a leader. You're right, Kerrigan. They will. If I'm to be that leader, I'll ask only one thing of you. Bring your swarm down outside the city. That will give us time to evacuate. Korhal is going to be the most difficult battle of my life. And you're asking me to make it harder. I am. Hmm. I was wrong about you, Valerian. You're not like your father. I'll give you your chance. Make the most of it. Kerrigan's got a heart, man. She's still human. We still got some human in us. Um, but damn, this is going to be intense, guys. Oh my god. I mean, this... I am so freaking excited to get this mission started. I mean, we're going to be making bases. We're going to be invading cities. This is going to be epic. That is terrifying. Oh, God. Every time I see it, it's disgusting, man. All right, so Zagara's got, we've got some new conversations to get through. Zagara, what's up? I have never seen so many Terrans. They are pulling everything back to defend this world. Their orbital defenses will kill millions of us before we even hit the ground. The Terrans have no chance. We are numberless. We are the Swarm. Hell yeah! Aisha? My queen. The swarm has assembled above Core Hall. The brood mothers await your command. Tell them to hold position in orbit. Stay out of range of the planet's defenses. Dominion fleets are converging on our position. Terran troops are arriving from all over the sector. Broodmother Kalisa, hear me. Have your Leviathans form a blockade. Kill anything coming into the system. Sweet! Nothing will stop us. Korhal is mine. How awesome is that planet, man? Oh my god, I love Blizzard games so much. Relay station! I sense a broad frequency emanating from the palace in August Grad. Yes, I sense it too. I can hear. Dominion forces, this is your Emperor, Arcturus Minsk. Korhal is under attack by the Zerg Swarm. Damn, Our how loud is weapons that? lab has been that? destroyed. Our defenses stripped. Any fleet that can hear my voice, return to Core Hall. The seat of human power is under assault. Come in. Defend your home. You have Trapped a like a rat in a cage, aren't you, Arcturus? I will admit, that is a sweet name, though. Alright, let's do this thing, people. Let's just check the evolution pit just one more time. Ooh, Abathic got a new conversation. I need a weapon to destroy Korhal's orbital defenses, and I need it fast. Can modify virophage sequence. Would concentrate bile. Expel as projectile. Oh, God. Can you get it working in time? Survival of swarm dependent on evolution. Iteration. Trust process. Trust sequences. Swarm will not fail. Sweet! Well, I don't know what Abbott is up to, but he's definitely doing something awesome. Alright, let's do this, guys. To the mission! The swarm is engaged with Core Hall's orbital defenses. We are ready to begin the surface invasion. How awesome is that background over there, man? That is so sweet. My queen, your leviathans are in position. Unleash the swarm. We will lose countless drop pods in the opening moments. We're sending millions. Even if only a fraction gets through, it'll still be more than enough to take out these orbital defenses from the ground. That is what I'm talking talking about, man. Just swarm that. Swarm it. 
everything. Just swarm this place like nobody's business. Oh my goodness. Zerg drop pods will arrive gradually over a wide area. Be prepared to divide your forces across a large battlefield. Oh my goodness, guys. We are playing across a massive map. I'm assuming we're going to be having multiple bases. We're going to have to keep ourselves 100% on top of our micro We got to make and our macro. We've got to make sure all of our bases are saturated, defended. We need to make sure that we make uh, lurkers so that we can protect our expansions. We need to make sure that we've got a, a good... A pack of mutilists so that we can defend against any air incoming air attacks. What else do we need to remember, man? Oh my god, there is so much to do. We have got burrow, burrowing uh, ultralists that we can aim to get eventually. We've got guardians that we can make, infestors to try and shut down any massive bio balls of human um, marines and freaking god knows what is going to be thrown in us right now. But we, I need to get my micro ready, man. I'm warming up my hands. Let's do this, baby. This is going to be sweet. Oh, my God. Okay, so this is going to test my freaking StarCraft 2 skills to the maximum, guys. I really hope that I can get through this without failing. Um, stick with me, guys. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be awesome. Um, it looks like we're going for that giant pyramid in the middle there. Um, let's get it out. Yeah, there's no way they're stopping that. A bio launcher has broken through the orbital defense network. Sorry, blast it! Dominion ground forces have secured this area. Our bio launchers cannot survive without support. I'm going to handle this personally. Sweet. Okay, it's the Kerrigan. Kerrigan is coming first. Now that is how you make an entrance. Send in all the drop pods. They should be centered around this region. Alert me the moment one breaks through. I'll make sure the launcher survives. Awesome. Okay, so we've got our first base. Here's Kerrigan. Let's make sure that we saturate control group four. Um, yes. Let's get these together. Control group two. Our mutilists are going to be control group three. The first bio launcher and its escort are entering Core Hall's atmosphere. Just make sure that we Show make gas. Where it will now, land. what I it want to do is scout here, around with my mutilists, my see if we can find an expansion. Um, I want to get an expansion done as soon as humanly possible. Um, so the first location is going to be over here, right? So what we need to do is make sure that we are. Uh, we've got 16 out of 24 drones, but what we do need to do is make a roach warrant and a hydrogen. You've made a grave mistake setting foot on my world, Kerrigan. I will deliver you and your swarm back to whatever hell you crawled out of. Dude, you look like Bruce Willis, man. The Such swarm has met the enemy. Our conquest. What is it this time? The swarm right. conquers all. Our forces oh God! Are under Incoming! Incoming Vikings! Let's get our hydralis over here, man. We need to take out these freaking Vikings. Um, right, so I think what I'm going to do is build some hydralis. Because it looks like that uh, we might be having an air in, an incoming air attack before anything else. And I want to make another hatchery. The bio macro launcher hatchery. is about to land. It will be vulnerable for a short period. Let's get. <laughs> Okay, Aisha, we'll get our army there. Let's get our army to that location. Let's make our second hatchery, just like this. Control group four. Let's rally the to Kerrigan. The Dominion's Draken defense network is destroying most of our biomarchers in orbit. And Which I means make we can't afford to lose the ones that get through. No oh God, you coming? Get this uh, this thing down. Now, what I want to do is make lurkers. So we need to upgrade the hydralis den into a lurker den. Um, lurkers are obviously really, really good in this situation. And I think what I want to do, you see, we don't have enough gas, man. We need to find a freaking expansion ASAP. Um, let's see if there's an expansion. Oh, God. That looks like an expansion to me. Um, let's start laying some uh, some zerg juice up in here. Peace. Let's expand the creep on this side. Now, what I really want to do, right, is make some lurkers. So I'm going to make a whole bun a bunch of 
Hydralis, and we're going to start making some lurkers. How many have we got here? We've got four Hydralis. Um, we need, that means we need 400 gas. Damn, we need a lot of gas for this jazz, man. Uh, are certainly, yes. I mean, uh, lurkers what? are certainly gas-heavy units. Speak. Let's add another cheap tumor over here. Man, the music is so intense. Check out all my hydras, man. That is a little sweet. Um, right, so. What is, what are we trying to do here? Well, what we're trying to do is get an expansion. So I'm going to make a whole bunch of raptors so that we can assault this bunker over here with, uh, with the raptors. And, um, we just stop piling our gas, basically. Oh, it check it out. It's, it becomes like a little bit That is sweet. Let's get these hydrants back here. The next um, bio launcher is breaking through Core Hall's defenses. Attack that bunker location, Raptors! Your queen Attribution. Mutation. Complete. I'm not seeing an expansion. Mix will suffer. Yes. Right, let's turn these into lurkers because that is our current plan. Um, we are reliant on gas man we need to find ourselves some more freaking gas um this is not good these gates Let's lead these to the down. Terran capital destroy them and my brood can enter august grad okay sweet so now we have a secondary oh god we have a secondary objective and that what? is to destroy those gates that means that we're going to need a, a, a mobile f maybe maybe an air army maybe we should be going air actually Retribution. Let's do a little bit of scouting over here on this side. Um, let's make a whole bunch more raptors also. It is time. Okay, so there is Redact. another another um, location over here to assault. So once my raptors arrive. Okay, sweet. So we've got some lurkers here too. So let's get our lurkers down here. You guys are going to burrow over there. And uh, these lurkers are going to come and defend this one over here. All right. Let's do this. Speak. Assault this location. Oh god. Maybe this is apocalypse time, right? Oh yeah. It's apocalypse time. Bam. Yes. Oh god. That did not go well. All right. Let's make a butt ton of roaches. Roaches, are, of course, make um, you know their own armor, basically. So that's pretty sweet. Right, Speak. let's start our assault. Your queen listens. Man, these things are just gobbing everywhere. That is absolutely disgusting. Um, right, so we lost all of our mutilists, but we are desperate for gas right now, people. We need to find some gas. What um, is it this time? I'm going to assault this location with this huge batch of um, roaches and kerrigan. No time out. Out. Let's focus fire the Thor. And there the little yes. roachlings come in and they are making I quick work of this place. What is this thing? Where? What the hell? Oh god, we don't have any anti-air units. Well, I'm not here. What is it this time? Makes Speak. Boldly. A bio is about to arrive on Core Hall's surface. Heal! What is it this time? Man, check in my roachling. Going to town on this on the jazz. Oh god, is under this attack. is not good! Attack! Make raptors! There's our expansion, guys. That is what we need right there. So once we have uh, secured this location over here, we're going to be going for um, that expansion. Retribution. Our forces are under nice. attack. Oh god, that science vessel can see our lurkers. That is not good. Behind no! Cluster is under attack. Our forces are under attack. My queen, the next bio launcher is landing in hostile territory. The Dominion base must be destroyed to secure the landing area. Let's see if we can actually bust into this Sons expansion. Of Core Hall. Um, just using Eliminate the small the Queen force of over Blades. here. It doesn't look like we can. It looks we like we're gonna use units that lose can all of our freaking units. Oh god! Hydralisks or mutalisks 
will allow us to destroy the enemy's flyers. All right, we need to make some some mutilus, guys. So I'm gonna make a mutilus den. I'm losing focus over here, guys. Oh God! It is time. What is it this time? Okay, so we didn't manage to take down that base, unfortunately. That is not good. We do need a butt ton more rotions though, so let's get that done. Kerrigan should be able to uh, basically deal with this herself. And uh, we've got Apocalypse back, so why don't we get an Apocalypse down on, um, on this thing. Oh god, what is that? Incoming! Make your peace. Okay, so I these roaches are going to go and deal with this jazz over here. It is and Kerrigan is going to nuke the base by herself. Bam! Feel the wrath of the swarm. Our forces are under attack. I'm sure Kerrigan can tank that thing, actually. More roaches! What I'm desperate it? for another base. Absolutely desperate for another base. So, Kerrigan needs to take this thing out. And we need to get another hatchery up here. ASAP. Is this is now actually getting red serious. Um, because we need to make a butt ton of mutilus. Once we get this new base set up, we're going to make a butt ton of mutilus. Let's just make sure we're always upgrading. I, for I forgot about the upgrades. The drones are under attack. They hide. Ooh, there's another base over here too. That is excellent. That is really excellent. Your queen listens. Feel the wrath of the swarm. No, no I'm carrying it. The present. Our Man, that this four is glitching out like nobody's business. What the hell? Yes. All right. Back up. Back up. Let's let's regather what's going on here. Let's. All right. We've got an incoming the attack over here. The next launcher is making landfall. Prepare for its defense. It's gonna make a whole bunch of raptors. And Kerrigan is on her way. These roaches are gonna come around here and get Kerrigan. We need to go and defend this location over here. And this is actually another expansion for us. So that is awesome. Mineral Let's use field. these um, needles to come and take out. I think this is a siege tank over here actually. And we need to make a hatchery here ASAP. That was not a good idea. That, that was uh, the mother of bad ideas. Alright. So, let's get this down over here, right? And I think what we need to do is make a couple more hydralis and um, a butt ton more raptors and what we Your need to do is assault this location over here it looks like there's actually another entrance into this base no um, time over here. The so speak i am the, the next bio launcher will arrive in enemy territory oh my lord more raptors okay this is getting intense people i I am worried that we're not going to be able to do this. Um, let's let's get our, all of our army gathered here. We need to assault this location right here with everything that we've got. Let's do, let's do it. Let's throw everything we've got at them. We've got to bust through this location. We need to take that other base, man. We need the gas so bad. Right, just stockpiled on drones there. Incoming Raptors. We should be able to secure this location now. Um, Looks like we've got a drop over here. That's fine. Let's get back to this position over here. Make sure that everything is uh, sorted. We're going to make some... What is it this time? These lurkers are going to stay here. And uh, what we need to do is solve this location over here. No! Mineral field depleted. Mineral field depleted. We've got to take out this drop, man. All right. Now... We've got more gas. That is the most important thing here. We've got more gas. So these guys are going to stay over here. Right? What is it this time, your queen? And what we need to do is get our army to this location over here. These lurkers are going to 
um, look after this. I think what I'm going to do is send these locusts to this base. And uh, now we can actually make another hatchery over here, which is excellent. So we can take that gas. Um, let's actually build these geysers now because we don't need um, workers to mine them, which is awesome. Um, Night wolves, you have your orders. Remove Night wolves. the Zerg threat. Take them out. Man, they decided to drop in the wrong place. It is. You're in my way. Yes. Miles. Sweet. Make your peace. Oh God. All right. Now we need to make a whole ton of mutilus where possible. Because Kerrigan right now is the only unit that can attack air in this army, so we are not looking good on um, <laughs> on that front. Looks like they killed my freaking drone also that was going to make uh, another gas thing over here, so that sucks. The final also, bio launcher is about to arrive. Prepare for its defense. Attack! Attack, Roachlings! Nice! Nicely done! Alright, now we've got a butt ton of gas, right? So now we can start making our mutilous army. Um, so this is going to be our ground army. Looking no pretty good, I think. Like um, I think there's another mutilus over here. Yes, there you are. So let's get this mutilus over here to join his brethren up in his business. And it uh, looks like we can make some more workers over here. And in our third base, we can also uh, make two more drones. That's going to saturate that. So that is awesome. What is this? This position is now going to be defended quite nicely. And um, under attack. Let's make sure that we're upgrading. We need to start upgrading our air units. We need to make sure that we're always upgrading our ground units, which I neglected to do. So let's get that done. And that yes. is a freaking battle cruiser, man. Make your peace. Luckily, Kerrigan is like <laughs> a ridiculous anti-air unit all in herself. Um, she could pretty much take on anything that they throw at us. So we need to take down these gates, right? That is what they've been saying to us. Um, Retribution will be mine. So let's let's have a look. Is it actually possible? Let's have a look. Attack! Attack the gate! Alright, now I'm going to st start um, reinforcing this Mutalus army with a butt ton of Mutalus. And uh, we're going to see if we can actually take out these gates. I don't know what these buildings do, man, because they're white on the map. I don't know if that means anything. Um, right, can we upgrade any air? Nope. Let's just make sure that we're always just making mutilus, man. We need to make a bunch out of mutilus. Oh god, another big bertha! Four Hall's defense cannons have been destroyed. Nice. The swarm is gathering on the surface. Yes! Destroy the Dominion's bases. Drive them into the city. Awesome! Okay, so the next part of our, our mission is to destroy, basically kill the Terran base. Our so queen has destroyed a gate. Move into the city! So that is one gate down. I'm going to send my Mutalist Force to go and suffer. take the next gate out. Looks like we've got Boldly. a little um, little strike force over I here. What I do want to do I'm though... Attack. Ooh, that was, that was not smart. Okay, so we can't actually assault... Oh god. Oh god, that, that was terrible. That Ooh, was absolutely queen. terrible. Retribution. Um, right, so the next assault is going to have to be a ground-based assault, I think. Because... Um, it looks like there's a yes. butt ton of anti air here Our in front of this gate, right? So we're gonna take our little, um, our, well, it's not, it's not exactly little, but we're gonna take this force of roaches and kill and assault this gate over here. What is it this and, uh, time? you know what time it is, people? Make it's freaking apocalypse time, man. Right. I wanna make a whole a ton of hydrolytes, man. We need to get some DPS in our army. And, uh, it is apocalypse time. Take apocalypse to the bottle. That is what I am talking about. Where is Armida's army? Okay, so Armida's army didn't die completely, which is good. That is another, another gate down. Another gate has fallen. Flood their pitiful city. Sweet. Science vessel fights the dust. Mutilus are just getting their ass in oath. So, oh, we can actually make them into Broodlords. Let's do that. So let's upgrade our Spire. Um, 
What do we need for this? A hive. Okay, so we've got to upgrade our lair to a hive, then we can make guardians. What we haven't made is ultralisks, but we need a hive to do that. So, um, oh god, there's a flankage coming on up in here. Take it! Right, sweet. Right, let's make sure that we're upgrading. Our forces are under attack. Our conquest continues. Speak. Alright, so we got one more major gate to Make take out. Make your peace. I don't know what these are, but I, I'm guessing that we have to take out these spaces before we get there. Um, let's get our mutilists out of here, man. Go and sit in here. You're going to become um, guardians pretty soon. The swarm conquers all. Right, so we have our hive. Let's make... Oh, God, these aren't even mining. Let's make an ultralisk cavern. And let's upgrade our spire so that we can make some guardians. We are going to make our stand over here, man. All of these mutilists are going to become guardians in a moment, and it is going to be freaking sweet. Right, let's have a look at our bases. That is saturated. This is, is almost saturated. Um, we are under attack over here. Right, back up a bit. Back up a bit, everybody. Back up a bit. Kerrigan. Heal this wall. Sweet. Right. Greatest Fire is ready. That means we can make these mutilists into guardians. Go, guardians, go. Oh my god, this is going to be awesome. We haven't got ultralists. Um, ultras in here. So let's make some ultras. Oh my goodness. How much gas is that? 200 gas. Damn. Well, we've got one ultralist on the way. So that is sweet. Um, we've got all of our gas here pumping away quite nicely. So that is epic. And we'll have one ultralist, man. We'll have one, one ultralist. In <laughs> oh god. Bits of drop pod falling everywhere. That is pretty disgusting. Right, so our brood lords are ready, guys. That means it that the Terran time. are in trouble, man. We are going to assault this Make location. Oh, chicken! I'll look at our our um, lurkers no doing work like there, the man. That's awesome. And these lurkers are going to do work over here too. Check it out, man. Eat it. That is what I'm talking about. Okay, so where is our ultralist? There he is. Um, Burrow charge! And here's another one. Okay, awesome, guys. This is going to be awesome. Let's see if we can actually time this properly. So, guardians, go in. What is it this time? Blitzkrieg! No time. And I'm going to make these ultralists um, do their burrow charge as soon as I see something to burrow charge. Like that, for example. Wow! Sweet! <laughs> that was epic! Nicely done! Very nice! Right, our guardians are going to do their business over here. Alright, so, we need to go to this bridge over here. This bridge looks like a, that's the last stand. So, to the bridge we go! Let's get a, a, a few more raptors in there. We are now maxed out, guys. 200 over 202. That Move means quickly. we are completely maxed Zagara, out. All we can do take now take your is brood upgrade. into the city while I deal with the remaining Dominion forces. Yes, my queen. Listens. Right, let's take out this this uh, barracks over here with our guardians. Mix. Yes. Man, this army is looking crazy, crazy nasty, man. Damn him. So that is taken care of just like that. It is now we've got to get our army across this bridge, man. This is going to be... Uh, it's either going to be a bottleneck or we're just going to pummel through. So why don't we get our guardians into position Your and let's charge is... over. What is it this time? I'm ready to borrow charge. I've got my ultralist selected. And uh, let's make sure that we don't bottleneck ourselves here. Yeah. Heal! Apocalypse! Breedlings are coming in from the side. Let's reinforce with raptors because they are the fastest unit that what we've got. What is it this time? Wow, that apocalypse didn't actually do anything. I am the swarm, yes. Nice! Into the city we go! 
Dominion forces are in full retreat. Isha, have my broodmothers deploy their forces. Zagara, move your brood further into the city. Take up positions around the palace. Yes, my queen. Man, if I it's was in the city right now, <laughs> I would be creeping myself. Nice, what an epic freaking mission that was, guys. Oh my lord. New strains available for the Ultralisk. That we, we've got a last and final evolution mission, it seems, for the Ultralisk. Um, it looks like we've got 119 Kerrigan kills. We didn't lose any launches, um, but we didn't get the Death Star to destroy three Augustrad gates before the fifth Bile Launcher lands. Oh, whatever, man. Um, that was epic. Oh my goodness, guys. What an epic stage. We are basically in the heart of the Terran homeland with the target set on Minx's face. Isha has been sharpening her claw finger uh, butthole probe and damn, is she going to go to town on Minx? Your revenge is close now. Nothing can stop it. Don't underestimate Minx. He is by far the most cunning enemy we've ever faced. If I should fall, you must take the swarm from Core Hall. Flee? This is not the way of the Zerg. Yet it is my will. You will obey my command and take the swarm to seek our true enemy. Find Amon. Destroy him before he can enslave the swarm again. As you command. Well, Amon was born before the universe, so good luck with that. <laughs> but guys, I really hope you enjoyed that mission, man. That was absolutely epic. Oh my god, that really pushed my uh, my micro skills to the maximum. Damn. But we got to use Lurkers, Ultralisks, Guardians. We, we, we did a good mix of uh, unit usage there, so that was awesome. Guys, if you have enjoyed this episode, you know what to do, man. You hit that like button. If you haven't subscribed yet, smack that subscribe button because we are getting near the end of this campaign, I assume. Probably a couple more missions left and I cannot wait to get started. Guys, this has been Randog playing StarCraft 2 Heart of the Swelm. We'll see you in the next video. Goodbye, my friends!